the, the goal at the camp is to teach the kids how to translate a song into American Sign Language. We came across one of the music videos you did with different schools. I realized maybe we should host a workshop here in Delaware. What are we doing now? All the kids are gathered together in groups brainstorming different ideas. This process is called pre-production for filming. The one we did at the camp was very much, um, it was sort of amateurish because we were all like doing it for the first time. We had never really experienced being behind the camera and we'd never experienced making something on our own. And that feeling of making something on our own was really cool, but um, it's awesome to kind of be in front of the camera too and just see how it's done for real. The D10 workshop were in a way kind of fun, um, tough. But it was enjoyable. Let's see. Camp was really fun because uh, we were allowed to um, come up with our ideas for the song. Like we were able to express ourselves in the song. What do we want to do with the song? The experience yesterday inspired me to think about attending college to be a film editor. I very much would like that to happen. was to empower these kids, for these kids to make decisions themselves. That was really my goal there. Like you showed them what to do and then you let them go. And if they weren't successful, they looked to you, you gave them confidence, you kind of encouraged them a little bit, and then you backed away again. We all had jobs to do in the song. Some of us were director, like I was the director with Jeffrey. Um, some of us were learning how to um, fix the lights and many others were performers in the video. Most classes tend to be four or five students, but the past two days, they all came together in large groups. It's not often they all work together in large groups like that. They did a great job. We taught them about communication, about teamwork, getting through struggles and obstacles. They were able to overcome that. It was great to see. I would suggest other schools to request DPAN to host two to three day workshops. It is a short workshop, but it is very beneficial for all students because deaf and hard of hearing students need role models to see what is out there and to be a part of something big. Interested in hosting a DPAN workshop? Click the link to contact us at dpan.org workshop.